what's up y'all and welcome back to life with vanessa y'all in today's video i am about to do a seafood boil so anyways y'all i did this video on my vanessa way tv channel and i feel like it did pretty well so i'm about to come over here and do it again and then i'm finna do the recipe for y'all as well plus the mukbang and i'm gonna have my dad and my uncle in this video again so that they can taste it and tell y'all how good it is and how much y'all need to try this recipe so y'all don't forget to like comment and subscribe ring the notification bell so that you'll be notified each and every time your girl posts the video and then let's go ahead and get into what you guys need for this recipe these are all the products that you need i have my honey it does not have to be organic i have some real limon 100% lemon juice i have some lemon pepper some lemon and pepper seasoning i have some garlic minced garlic what is a seafood boil without minced garlic like this is so good then i have some frank's red hot hot sauce and then i have some parsley flakes and i have some paprika now this gives it that good nice flavor and then i also have some seasoning salt which i will be using for the crab legs i'm going to show you guys how i do that and then of course garlic powder we have to have the garlic powder and then i just add a little bit of ground red pepper not that much because you don't want it to be too too hot and then I have my butter. It doesn't have to be this brand. You can use whatever butter you would like. And then I have some of my potatoes. Now, yeah, I'm going to chop these potatoes up because they're too big and I want the flavor to get all into these. So I'm going to show you guys, you know, everything that I do. And then I have some oven bags, large size oven bags. It doesn't have to be this brand. But make sure they are large or turkey size. It doesn't really matter. So these are all the products that I'm going to be using, guys. And let's go ahead and get into it. All right, now, y'all, I have two big old bags of crab legs, y'all. My cousin sold us some crab legs, and y'all, I had to bring some over here to share with my dad and my uncle. And then I have some sweet corn, some super sweet corn because I love my corn to be like super sweet. And then you got all the flavors from everything else. And then I also got some of these extra large easy peel raw shrimp. Um, my cousin sold these to us too. So yeah, I'm about to go ahead and wash everything up. Um, and then I'm gonna get back to y'all once I season and everything and show you guys how everything is done okay y'all first thing is first i have my uh, potatoes boiling in high heat so right now these are boiling you want to get them at least like a nice soft not like like um mashed potato soft but you want to get them like nice and soft so that when you bake them they're extra good okay y'all and right next to it i have my uh shrimp I got my crab soaking in water. Why am I to clean my shrimp? And y'all definitely want to make sure you know you get them clean. Now these have shells on them, but they already are deveined. I hope I'm saying that right. But yeah, you just want to make sure you're cleaning all of your seafood off. Don't want to feed anybody disgusting, not clean seafood. <laughs> I have my two large bags side by side because I don't think all of the four pounds of crab legs are gonna fit all into one. So I got two of them and then I got them on like a cookie sheet so that they can go into the um, oven. Okay y'all, so I have my, my big old bowl of fresh crab legs that are all clean. So I am going to first use my seasoning salt. And I'm sorry y'all, my hands are like super ass. <laughs> My hands are ashy, y'all, because I keep on putting them in water. But um, you're going to, at the top of your crab cluster, you are going to use some seasoning salt. And you're going to put it at the top. Hey, mama. You said, what's the so now y'all are going to go ahead and put all of my corn inside of the bag. So right now you're kind of just putting everything into your bag. So that's what I'm doing, y'all. And then I'm going to be back to y'all once I have, um, 
once I'm about to season everything up. All right, y'all. So, um, I know a lot of people was asking me, what do I set the oven on? So, I'm going to do bake. I'm going to type in 400. And then I am going to start oven. So, I just took my potatoes out of the boiling water. And they are cut like this. So, if y'all don't have um, the small circular ones, because the store that I went to, they didn't have it. So I had to get, you know, medium sized ones, but you could just cut it and that way you can get some good flavorful uh, potatoes. You don't want to leave them whole or anything because you want to make sure your potatoes got a lot of flavor in them. So right now I'm just putting them all into the bag and then after that I just got to season it up. How it looks inside of your bag at the end once you have everything in there. This is exactly how it should look. How it looks. Hey, YouTube. Hey, hey, Uncle Drew on the house. My daughter done made another seafood boil for me. Y'all know I love this, so I'm finna <laughs> dive in um, and, and, and tie this up. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? No way. This, All right. This stuff is delicious. I wish y'all could taste it. Oh, so I, I got a wrap. Y'all want to hear a wrap? Yep. <laughs> hey, believe it or not, your daddy used to rap when he was young. Right. Hey, check this out. <laughs> I'll bust a rap for y'all. What? <laughs> All right, let me let me bust this. Then I'm gonna bust a rap. <laughs> All right. Now this that old school. This ain't none of that new school stuff. But hey, but life always the same. It don't never change. Right. So check it out. Listen to this story. It's my reality. From ghetto hell to heaven, it's my destiny. I started young, a boy, growing to be a man. And I started poor, I wanted money in my empty hand. I'm gonna spit over the food. <laughs> <laughs> trying to get you a beat going. That's all right, I don't need no beat. <laughs> <laughs> Listen to this story. It's my reality from get to hell to heaven. It's my destiny. I started young, a boy, growing to be a man. Now I started poor, I wanted money in my empty hands. Now all my homies selling dope and getting their money on. I did the same, I was broke. So tell me, am I wrong? And now I'm rolling in my drop shop. I'm flossing down the rings, not understanding the jealousy that this life would bring. My homie tried to rob me, put a gun up to my head. Give me your money and your dope is what that nigga said. It was the brother down the street in the end house. And cause I knew him, I knew he tried to take me out. I had no fur of 45 was in my pocket. The only thing I had to do was get it out and pop it. I grabbed a barrel of his gun and moved it to the side. It was hot when he shot, but if I let go, I would die. I got my gun and when he saw it, he looked in my eyes. It was his last I caught that night. That nigga died. I live to see another day, another lesson learned. The shedding tears for the brothers that I had to burn. Now, some believers get to hell would be the death of me. But I live on, get on heaven, it's my destiny. <laughs> What's up? Like What's up? I like that. Boy, that's that old school. <laughs> that old school. I like that. They don't know about that, man. I like that. All right, here I go. Let me get one. Let me get one. Go ahead. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> uh oh, y'all done got me in the rapping spirit now. Hey, that was pretty good, though, yeah. man. Oh, no, think, cool. you should try to rap, too. Y'all think that was good? Check this out. All right. Now, picture, if you will, a man. Demonstrating solely off a carefully made plan. Reaching my dreams on a step-by-step -step basis. 
forever rising to each and every occasion. This is get your hell where I started at. So make sure you picture me proud, strong and black with my family by my side. Man, woman and child, I started off in one step and I've been walking for miles and at the end of my journey, that's my destiny. And since I started from hell, I know it's heavenly. You only get one chance and now's the time to take it. I wrote some get your hell and so I know I make it. Now what you hearing is coming from the heart of me. And what I'm making is my kiddo having destiny. <laughs> I like that one too. Mm -hmm. I like that one too. Now listen. If y'all want to book a concert or whatever, <laughs> call Uncle Drew. <laughs> uh, I, get, I get you in. But that comes to the end of this video, y'all. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Ring that notification bell so that you'll be notified each and every time I post a video. And y'all, we're going to try to do this again, but with a different meal. Next time, I want y'all to try my uh, macaroni and cheese and my hot cheeto chicken y'all still haven't tried my favorite meal we're gonna try that next time people i'm looking forward to that action yeah because i said it a long time ago but then i i forgot so we gotta do that one day just just let me know all right just all right all right peace y'all peace out you peace.